Are you worried that cable or streaming subscription services like Netflix or YouTube TV are costing you too much money? There's a way you can enjoy streaming TV without the pain of a monthly bill. In fact, you can do it for free and never hand over a credit card or any personal information. Before you switch, you need to figure out if the available free streaming services are right for your household. Here are five questions you should ask yourself before making the leap to free streaming TV. Question one, do I have the proper devices and equipment? The good news is that most free streaming TV services are accessible through multiple devices. Many of these services have free mobile apps that you can download to your smartphone. Some also have channels that you can add onto your favorite streaming device, like a Roku or Amazon Fire TV stick. There also are streaming players on the web that you can use from your laptop or home computer. If you've already cut the cord and are paying for subscription streaming services, you likely have the things you need a strong internet connection, and a device capable of streaming the free apps on your phone, television, or computer. Question two, am I ready for the commercial trade-off? If you're used to a subscription streaming service like Netflix or Disney Plus, you've likely become accustomed to a commercial free viewing experience. Free streaming TV services make their money by airing commercials with the content. That's the trade-off for skipping out on those monthly subscription bills. Not only do the commercials test your patience as a consumer, but they also add to the amount of time required to stream a TV show or movie. So what you're saving in a monthly bill, you're paying for with time. It's worth noting that the advertisement experience is not the same among free streaming services. Check out our reviews of each individual streaming service linked in the description below to get the scoop on how bad the ads are. Question 3. Am I willing to give up the latest and greatest content? If you're attached to the latest drama on HBO, or binge-watching new Netflix series when they come out, free streaming TV is probably not for you. If it's popular content, it may be a few years old and not nearly as in demand as it once was. There's an abundance of content available on free streaming services, but you may not be able to access everything that you've grown fond of on premium streaming services. Question 4. Am I willing to shop around to find the content that I like? The good news about jumping into the free streaming TV game? The options are increasing frequently. The bad news? You may have to surf a few services to find the content you want to consume. Content options change often for free streaming services. So while a movie you like on Netflix may be there for years, a free streaming service might only offer that movie for a few weeks or months. So if you see something you like, it's probably best to watch it soon. Nearly all the free TV streaming services have a new or featured content section that showcases the newest and best movies and TV series available on the service. I'd suggest downloading a handful of the popular free streaming services and surveying some of the available content before canceling your paid content. Question 5. Beyond saving money, do any of the perks to dumping subscription services matter to me? Yes, free is the biggest selling point for most of these free streaming TV services. But there are other advantages to breaking away from subscription streaming services. For instance, you do not have to provide credit card information to receive content on free streaming services. So you don't have to worry about automatic renewals or data breaches. Many free streaming services do not even require that you sign up for an account. That means personal information like your home address, phone numbers, and email addresses stay private. If you download a free streaming service and don't like what you see, you can be in and out of that platform in a matter of minutes. That puts the onus on the free streaming services to provide a good experience to keep you around. After you answer these five questions, you may be ready to give free streaming TV a try. At Clark.com, we've reviewed many of the most popular free streaming options to give you a comprehensive guide to free TV streaming. What's your favorite TV streaming service? Tell us in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to our channel and check out some of our other videos about cutting the cord. And find more information about saving money every day at Clark.com.